treasures it has been a while, a long while. With the hour update on Sunday, it is what 4:40. Looks like 4:40. And I'm back at the Duluth Clothing Company because yesterday my mom was driving and I thought I saw some copper wire. So yeah, I drove back here on my way home to see if there's any copper wire still in the area right over here somewhere. So yeah, just got here a little bit ago. About less than a minute ago, actually. Alright, let's do this. Maybe I'll get lucky and find something else. Uh, it might be a short video, but hey, you know. Hopefully, I don't get run over. Lots of cars going fast. Okay, I believe it was over here, but then again, a street sweeper could have come by and already um, swept it up, and that's probably the case. So, I thought it was in this area. Oh, there it is, right there. Yep, copper wire, baby. Heck. Yeah, alright, so the street super didn't get it. Now, the other day, I found two pieces of copper wire uh, when I was leaving the post office, but because it was such a busy um, area, I decided not to record just to be safe. But I do have it in my car still. Alright, I might look around a little bit more just to give it a little bit longer video than a minute and 40. <laughs> The sun is going down, so I think I will take off my sunglasses so I can see better. So, let's see here. Sunglasses off. Got my new pants on. Oh, it got dirty. It's okay. Alright, so the other day, I'll put this one right here. The other day, I got this big piece here, see? And also near it was this little piece by the post office, but it was right at the entrance that was, um, had a busier roadway there, so it was harder to try to get that. Alright, let's take a look around, because I really haven't looked around this parking lot before, so we'll do that. Alright, people are coming out of Duluth, so hopefully I'm going to recordings. Hmm. Over here, we got an uh, empty bottle. Yep. Okay, I don't want to lose my phone in that. It's interesting that they got too close by, so it must kind of be flooding here because it looks like a downgrade right there. And we got these nice sharp things that like to slice and dice you up if you dare to enter them. Uh huh. try to walk around the edge of the parking lot here a little bit. Maybe I'll go over that way a little bit too. Just so we can look around. See if we can find anything else that might be interesting besides the copper wire. Oh, and I did find a post office money order. The complete thing with the thing attached saying that it's your receipt that you're giving it to somebody else for $25. And that is why I was at the post office the other day. I cashed a puppy out. <clears throat> so, 25 bucks. Yeah. Oh, look at that rubble over there. Huh. I wonder what that's supposed to be. It's like no road going to it that I can tell. Hmm. Something had to have been there, right? And they took it away. Rock. Okay, I just stepped on. any new trespassing signs on this side and well, we can go over there and check it out huh? just maybe put them all in black but I'm in a parking lot but it's not that dark out yet so got my orange stuff in the car hoodie baseball cap you know that kind of stuff gotten my third vaccine shot for the COVID. I 
against the COVID. Somebody lost her band aid, I guess. Mm. Is it a band aid? Oh, latex. Yeah, I guess it's a band aid. It's amazing with this COVID thing going on that so many people throw their um throw their stuff on the ground. What is that? Huh, right twig. They throw their mask and their gloves all over the ground. Yeah. I like the Duluth company. I love their clothes. They're expensive but they're strong and tough for hard working people or hard playing people. So, yeah. Street sweeper people that come here to clean up and stuff. <clears throat> if it wasn't for COVID, I'd be picking up that can right now. Supposedly, it's not supposed to last for so long, but you don't even know how long it's really been there for real. Look at all that nice red clay. Alabama red clay. Ooh, Alabama red clay ant hills. Of them. Hmm. Huh. It's kind of funny, like they meant to go through here and then they decided, nah, I'm not doing it. <laughs> not doing it. See? Another mask over here. Hmm. Disposable one, but dark blue. Well, we'll go over here and check it out real quick, I guess. It's cool outside, but right now it's pretty good. Because these pants that I got uh, earlier this year, I bought it through the website. They were on clearance, and they're fleece-lined. And that's pretty nice because it feels good in the cool air. My legs are warm. So. Hmm. I wonder what used to be here. It's probably a right-handed glove. Usually I always find a left-handed glove. Don't know why. Hmm. Huh. Can I walk around here? Yeah, I don't have a gimbal yet uh, to try to keep my videos not so jerky and more steady. That's going to have to wait for me to purchase this. It's a piece of plastic. I thought it was slate. It's not like I'm gonna find any money or anything over here. If I do, it'd be a freaking miracle. Rocks. Instead of cement. Wow, those are huge. Why would they just pile them up here? That's crazy. I almost dropped my phone. Hmm. Kind of looks like they just kind of poured them out and chipped them all up here. It's got some rust in them. Natural rust, I guess. surprised there's not more trash over here, you know? Like people sitting over here and doing stuff. Hanging out. Hmm. Wow. Well, yeah. Hmm. Kind of weird. I smell like smoke in the air. 
Is that a giant? I can't see it. Uh, a giant hawk or something up there. On top of that sign right there by the D. It's huge. Alright. Keep on looking around. I like looking around at stuff. I miss going to the park. I kept saying I was going to make it this year, but I didn't make it. And now, of course, it's getting cold out. It's fall. I could still go. I mean, I've seen plenty of people go there yesterday when my mom was driving by it. But I like to go in the water. And a bit too chilly for that. I'm going to say that's just regular metal. It's all rusty. Yeah, normally I used to pick that up, but not today. I got to be able to get into my storage unit. It's kind of stuck right now. Door stuck. Anybody got a clue how to get it open? I appreciate it. Apparently something toppled it over somehow. Don't know how unless we had a mini earthquake. But anyhow, stuff fell over. That's just... um. That tarpy stuff, black stuff. Sometimes they're blue, sometimes they're like a off whitish gray color. Yeah, you can't really tell what was here. There's like no sign of where a building would have been or anything. It's just a big old parking lot. Huh. I wonder what it was. I'm trying to keep my phone steady, y'all, but you know how it is. You're just walking, holding your phone, you know. Do with what you got, you know. Make do. Hmm. I don't want to walk this whole thing. I mean, you can see it's pretty big. It looks like a smoky sunset, but it don't look that smoky in real life. Hmm. Huh. Could have been a building there. I don't know. Hard to say. Uh, Alright, so there's a little something over this way. Kind of shiny. It looks really big, so we know it's not money. But we'll check it out and see what it is anyhow. Uh, uh, probably a piece of plastic. This would be a good place to practice golf or driving, having your kid learn how to drive and stuff. Or yourself learning how to drive if you haven't learned yet. What's that? It's a big old chunk of metal. Now that's a heavier piece, so I guess I'll take that one. I like the heavy pieces. Stick it in my pocket because they ain't got nothing else with me. All right, let's go see what this... Ooh, hold on. Look at this heavy piece. Big old bolt thing. That's got some weight. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's got weight to it. We'll take that. I can, like a three-pounder there. Like lifting weights and stuff. Ooh, that could do some damage. Ooh, we're getting interest and stuff here. All right, so there's big washers. There's some nuts in. Yes, it's a piece of plastic. Hmm. Well, look at that. Huh. That seems like it might be not so heavy. Not so heavy. Maybe somebody took a car part out here. Piece of metal there. Kind of strange. That bolt was probably from a light pole that might have been out here at one time, but you can't tell that there was a light pole out here now. I think there's a hotel or something over there. Don't know. This here, doubt it's copper. It kind of looks like uh, not copper. What do you call that? Aluminum or something. 
see. Yeah, aluminum or something, see. Uh, not taking that today. Maybe never. Probably never. Huh. I mean, it is a parking lot. It was a chance to, to possibly, potentially, this fiberglass, finding at least a penny, but maybe not. little bit maybe it's dirty I'll take it anyhow but with the rest of the copper it might clean up it might not I got so much to work on it's ridiculous but I can't even get to it which is even more ridiculous check that out it's like a u-shaped nail with a bunch of stuff on there like little little necklace ring thingies Hmm. What is that? Seems really lightweight to my shoe. Maybe somebody had a fiberglass boat or car out here that they took apart. Hmm. Uh, it's getting dark, y'all. It's getting dark and potentially another piece of copper. Like I need any more, but like I said, I can't get to it right now. So my nose starting to run. It's cold out here. Uh, uh, possibly some more copper. Very thin, whatever it is. I just stick that in my pocket too. Maybe some more over there. You can't see it, can you? It's kind of white. Let's see here. See it now? Yeah, there you go. Let's go check it out. Zoom back out. Check it out. When in doubt, check it out. Yeah, I think so. Looks like it got burned or something. I got a big old piece. I have to go into the dirty copper pile. Yeah. I'll stick it in my other pocket. My other one's there. Alright, there. These guys do the somersault. Oh, I'm doing it backwards, sorry. Somersault and backwards. Oh my gosh, which way is it? That way? Okay. I just did y'all a flippy doodah. Flippy doodah. Mm, sorry, I was pulling up my sleeve, y'all. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Look at all this. Definitely some big bolts and copper conduit stuff. Is that a piece of brass? Could be. Oh, it's. people scraping stuff and it always comes off. Not for me. Take that bolt too, I guess. What is that? Like a pipe of some kind. Mm, a little nugget of stuff here. Huh. I can't get it all. Like I said, I don't have a bag with me. Now that looks like it could be copper again. Let's see here. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Let's pick it up. Other stuff again. Man. Oh, who knew I was gonna find so much stuff? Really wasn't expecting to find nothing but like so little and so much at the same time. I don't know. I 
probably can't get that cleaned up anymore, but we'll figure, I'll figure it out what it is, I guess, eventually. See if it's worthy or unworthy stuff. Go on a pile that's for scrap metal for 10, or is it gonna go in the scrap brass pile? The dirty brass pile, I guess they call it. Because it could be brass, although I couldn't get it to scrape, so it might not be. It's probably just tin. So, yeah. I hadn't even made it to the other part that I wanted to check out. Something red over here. Probably nothing but material. Or just red weeds. Red weeds. Okay. Well, no coinages. That I see. Ooh, I'll be up further than I planned. Okay. Time to go back. It's getting dark out here. Hmm. My car's like way over there. Blue dot in the distance. Could be coyotes out this way. Heck, they're closer to where I live at, so why not out here? Right? I sure do appreciate you guys watching my channel. I appreciate it when you guys smash that like button. It does help YouTube's algorithm and lets more people be aware that I do make videos. Few and far between right now, but hopefully things will pick back up again. Uh, if not the end of this year, the beginning of next year, maybe. There is life after COVID. What is that? Let's check it out. It's in the dirt. Oh, okay. That's a big old piece of rebar. Looks like a snake almost. That's huge. Uh -huh. Oh, it is loose. Well, heck, it's heavy too. Take it. Big old piece. It's heavy. I need to turn some scrap in for real. I kind of quit picking up stuff, but I enjoy it so much. It's like therapy for me, and it's cheap. And I get paid, and I don't have to pay a therapist. Huh? Yeah. It releases a lot of stress doing this. So if you got a stressful day at work or at home, just go out, walk, and pick up some stuff. Separate it, take it into your scrapyard, get some money for it. Yeah, it's not a lot, but still, better than nothing. Yeah. Okay, trying to make my way across this wasteland to this other area I was wanting to check out before I head back to my car over there. Ugh. Ah! Tripping on the greenery here. Hmm. Gotta watch where I'm going. There could be a hole here I don't even know about, right? So, oh, another piece of rebar. Big old chunky chunky. I'll see if I can pick it up also. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. Oh, Lord. I just want to take it back to my car, man. But I really wanted to check out this tiny little parking lot, too, with no building. Uh, okay. See what it looks like. Picking up some trash, y'all. Just picking up some trash. Oh, look. The weeds are got white flowers on them. Looky. Isn't that pretty? I wonder if that's something that that one lady would eat. I keep seeing a video saying, don't kill your weeds. Don't step on your weeds. You can eat it. You can make a delicious salad out of it. Thank you. Thank you. Hmm. Alright, we'll go over here and check out this area and then we'll head back to the car. Because this stuff is heavy in my hand. I'm going to wonder why my arm is sore later. Hmm. 
just a uh, uh, no. Definitely some mini dirt back here. There's some tire tracks. Some broken tree branches, probably from that tree right there. Huh. Yeah. Definitely was a parking lot. Got parking lines and stuff. But yeah, that person cut across the grass. I can see the tire tracks in there. Tire tracks. Huh. That is amazing. Getting busy around here, it's time to go. Guess that's it. Say goodbye to that parking lot, huh? What is that? Ouch. A piece of string. Losing all my goodies here. Mm. Ah, got it. Got it. Got back. Oh goodness. Ah, I'm almost back to my car. You ever wonder where all this copper wire comes from? How did it get there? Yeah. Who brought it there? Who dropped it there? Guess we'll never know. Somebody had it in their vehicle, a truck or something, and it just fell out. Well, guys, I want to thank you for watching Gold Bullion Treasures. And you guys have a blessed, safe, happy new year. Merry Christmas and happy Thanksgiving. Bye.